Boy, you don't know that we know about you What is up all my guys and goddesses and welcome back to the channel where it's been nothing but love, positivity, and happiness. And that's on what? That's on period. So as you can tell, my voice is leaving me, but disregard that for the video. But we are back, bitch, with a new LP. Get into it. <laughs> as you see, there are three beautiful bitches in this house and they are so cute. Congratulations again to the two winners of my contest, Dimplicity and Selena. <laughs> Um, your sims are going to be like the main sims, but then I just added on this third sim because it couldn't have been complete without her, honestly, <laughs> to me, but, um, these are the sims. This is Robin, this is Samira over here, and this is Brandy, and they are all beautiful bitches. Um, I want to say thank you again to Dimplicity for giving me a sim. Selena for giving me a sim. And this sim right here is by a girl named Melaine. Thank you again for all of your sims. Your sims are cute as hell, okay? And I just, like, redid something on them, but didn't really, like, give them, like, mad makeovers or anything like that. But let me give you the gist of this LP before we start because, you know, you know the first episode's always got to be a little chatty. So just bear with me and we're going to get into it. So, this right here, Robin, is the head bitch in charge of a gang called the Sim, Sim something, Sim Corta. So, I don't remember the name of the gang, but that's their gang. It's an all-lady gang, and she is the leader, the, you know, the gang leader. Sis, no, she got shit down pack, okay? <laughs> and Robin actually saved Samira from a life full of drugs and sex and all of that stuff back when she was like hooked on everything so she like gave her a place to stay and has been helping her ever since so in return robin asked her to be in her gang to you know just gain some money so that samira can eventually get on her own two feet and samira said sure you know i mean she told her that she don't have to do anything that she doesn't feel comfortable doing as far as like having sex with people and stuff like that but you do have to go out and make her money um <laughs> to live in this house you can't live here for free bitch so samira agreed and that's how they got here brandy is just one of robin's close friends who she you know she's been a stripper for a long time and <laughs> robin gave her the opportunity to make some more money you know on the side that was like an adrenaline rush for brandy as well brandy was just like bitch you know i'm down for anything so that's how brandy came into the picture okay okay so these three beautiful bitches will be the main characters of my new let's play so i hope you guys enjoy this let's play it's a game related let's play so girl we're gonna get into it okay i had slick started already because i was having troubles also they don't live in this household because you can't have like a gang in a household um they have to not live there so that's why they're roommates instead of um actually me controlling them so i will not be controlling them but the storyline will still apply let me give you guys a house tour before we continue this journey when you walk in this is what you see you see welcome to our home you see that picture over there it's a bad bitch picture that over there in the corner you know what i'm saying like you about to see it but this is technically what's in front of the house i decorated this house on my own i did it on stream so if you don't know i stream on twitch every monday wednesday friday and saturday uh typically at 9 p.m but if anything changes or i want to do it earlier i will definitely 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 let you guys know on my um twitter anyways this is the dining room i think it's like really simple really classy you know bitch real cute um <laughs> i'm gonna go to the kitchen next because that is like for here and we got shit clipping in shit but disregard because y'all know my ass can't really be like that but this is their kitchen and i'm really into like the gray and white and all that bullshit that's boring colors for kitchens so bear with me 
This is the living room, which the girls are in right now. That shit's clipping. Disregard. <laughs> but it's a really pretty fun living room. Like, bitch, we got drugs on the table, bitch. What you need? We got it. Condoms on the table. Magazines, bitch. We got it all. Whatever you need. We got money. <laughs> We got a whole bar over here because, bitch, if we having a party, we need it. That's just a bathroom that's little as hell. It don't even got a shower. So, like, now, this room right here is Robin's room that had bitch in charge. Her room had to be the baddest room because this bitch is the baddest bitch. Okay? Okay. Uh, she got the Louis Vuitton bed. Okay. Got, got the little desk over here. She got the little purple feel going on. Y'all know she's cute. This girl right here. Like, this room is so fucking cute. Okay. She's, Robin's really into music. And she's trying to start up a music career all while being, like, the the biggest gang. So, you know, she got that shit. She's like a rapper. And that's what she want to do. I'm going to show you her bathroom. This is her particular bathroom by herself. It's real classy. It's real nice. It's real white. You know, it's real simple. My bitch, like, it's simple. You know, she ain't got time for all that crazy shit. Okay, um, these are the girls, this is the girls' bathroom, the ones that share, um, Samira and Robin, this is their bathroom, it's really cute, it's really nice, it's really classy, you know, we keep it cool, sweet, and classy in this motherfucker, I'm really in love with that picture, <laughs> okay, but this room right here is actually Samira's room, Samira's really into art, these are some of her artworks that she did, um, She's just really into art, and she likes the color yellow, of course. <laughs> um, and it's a real simple room, you know. She tries to stay away from drugs, but sometimes a little weed, you know, help her mellow that shit out. She got her sneakers up here. You know, Samira is just real chill. I got her the little thing over there so she can do some art on there, too. Uh, she got some quotes up here for herself to look at every morning, like affirmation to read every morning. You know, real cute. This right here is Brandy's room. Brandy is the stripper, the best, okay? And so her room had to be cute. I was going to make it red and black, but the house is red and black. So I gave the bitch a pink room. Look, she'll be all right. But she liked looking at herself stripped, so I had to put her mirror over there. I could add more shit in here, but bitch, I don't feel like it. But this is basically the house. I hope you guys like it. You know, I did it on stream. So, if you was on my stream on Twitch, then, bitch, you already seen it. I put some little plants back here so they can grow their own weed. Because, bitch, buy it from who? Nobody. Um, nobody has time for that. Okay. But this is a cute little house. So, we're going to get started. I, um, I want to send someone on a robbery mission. So, we're going to send Brandy. Because Brandy looks like she'll get the shit done. We're still letting Samira get used to the fact that she's in a gang right now. So, we're going to let her get used to it. Um, this right here is Lorena. And this is the other girl that's in our gang. So, Brandy's going to go do that. And we're going to come over here and talk to Lorena a little bit. Um, let's talk about loyalty. Let's make sure this bitch is loyal. Bitch, you know you got to be loyal. You got to stay loyal. Um, <laughs> let's talk about the police. And then, let's um, talk about the history of the Simcura gang. I think that's what it's called. But we need to talk to Samira too because Samira needs to get the feel of the fact that she's in this gang now. We're not going to keep babysitting her. Uh, she's going to eventually have to go out and get my money. So she needs to get ready for that and understand that. So we're going to talk to her about it a little more too. So my whole no, like, bitch, you can't just be sitting around here. You know you got to make this money. I know you scared. I know you a little like, you don't know if this is the right idea. But... You, you stay in here, so you got to make some money, okay? My bitch is in there having sex with herself right now. Your roommates all paid their rent. Oh, cool. We getting money from them, too. On top of the fact that they got... That's what I'm saying. They got to go make money so that they can pay my rent. Because, bitch, you can't be staying here for free. Okay? You cannot be staying here for free. So, right now, she's just going to sit here and kind of bond with Samira because... Why not? You know, like, Samira is a little nervous about being in this gang. And we just want her to be comfortable and no, let her know it's okay. You know, girl, it's okay. We gonna be, we gonna be okay. But I think, girl, why you still ain't got no clothes on? That's my concern. But I think I'm gonna have her and Samira go out to dinner or go out to lunch. What time is it? Yeah, go out to, like, dinner, kind of. To get their mind off shit, you know? So this is the Sakura, Sakura uh, restaurant, and it is so beautiful, might I say so myself. But let's just request the table. Let's have sis come on, come on and eat. Okay, so we're going to order for each other really quick. 
Uh, I think I'm going to have a mimosa, and I think she wants a mimosa too. Let's just both have a mimosa. It's really cute. I think mimosas are such a girly, cute drink, you know? <laughs> so, my Sim is going to actually have some pho. Uh, she wants ramen, but, like, who eats ramen at a fucking restaurant, bitch? Like, we're going to get her some garlic noodles. Treat my bitch, okay? Show her these lifestyles that she can have if she just do what she's supposed to do. You know, and I'm going to like give them some things to talk about. First, I'm going to go ahead and talk to her about loyalty. Tell her that, you know, you can't just leave the gang whenever you feel like you're scared. Talk about respect. Uh, whenever you feel like you're scared, you know, you got to go do your job. And that is it. Let's tell her a funny gang story. Something that we went through while we were in this gang. Because we had other girls before them but you know she decided to give some other girls a chance which we have some girls still but you know she's trying to give the new girls a chance to show what they can do you know because uh, she know that they can do it especially Samira she believe she believes in Samira she know that Brandy gonna do the shit regardless because Brandy don't give a fuck we're gonna talk to her about the rival gang let her know what's going on with that like, bitch, there are other gangs out there. Don't think that we the only one. So, we got to step up, especially because we the only girl gang. And bitch, people don't be thinking that we the shit sometime. You heard? People be thinking that just because we are all girl gang, we can't do what they do. And, bitch, no. That's not how this shit works. <laughs> that's not how this shit works at all. So, now we just going to enjoy our meal together. My bitches look like two bad bitches. Oh, God. Okay. And Brandy better have my money. And I'm not joking. She better have my motherfucking money. Because if she don't, um, that's a problem. I don't play about this money. And I want all the girls in my game to know that if you go, if I send you out, you better come back with my money. Or Houston, we going to have a problem. Because... I didn't send you out for looks, bitch. I sent you out to go get my money. All right, so we're pretty much done. She's not going to finish that because this fucking restaurant shit is glitchy as fuck. We're going to go home, and we're going to go ahead and just go get our money from Brandy. <laughs> okay, so we are back home. Anyways, Brandy was fake sleeping and didn't want us to know because she probably don't even got our fucking money. Like, oh, she did. Okay. Oh, my cut was 14000 Yo, this this money, yes. This money is good money. You go, girl. I am so proud of you, bitch. Like, thank you. But we're going to have her come in here and pee. I'm going to just take care of my girl for a second. Uh, she already pretty much ate, but she can go in there and pee. And she's going to probably go to sleep for the night. Because tomorrow we're going to go meet up with our drug dealer and get some drugs and shit. I don't know what the girls are going to do. They are welcome to sleep or do whatever they feel like is necessary, you know. So, I'm going to go to sleep. Uh, my bitch is going to go to sleep for a second. We also... Oh, I forgot to show y'all. We got this hookah thing out here where we're going to smoke weed at together and shit. But not today because my bitch is sleeping. Okay. <laughs> okay, so she is up and ready to go. We're going to have her come over here in her bathroom and use it and I'll take a shower really quick and then we're going to I think today we're going to go meet some people after we send the girl to go take your shower bitch there you go yes we love it okay so we sent her on her mission now I'm going to go and try to meet my drug dealer really quick okay so I'm at my drug dealer's house right and if you watch my streams you know exactly who trinity is and trinity is so cute and she's like the chillest bitch i've ever seen she lives with other girls right now but that's not the point uh we came over here just for our drugs so we're gonna buy some some weed from my sis real quick because girl not a discount bitch not a discount bitch giving me a discount okay actually i'm gonna buy like seven of those just because i want to sell some too and we haven't grown any lately. So we're going to buy like seven of each. But we're going to smoke a couple. But Trinity is so damn cute. Okay. Trinity is the baddest bitch I've ever seen in my life. If we sleep with the drug dealer bitch. I don't know. <laughs> that might be the way to go. <laughs> Trinity used to be in our gang. But then I don't know. She just decided to just be like. You know just sell drugs. And that was cool with us. Because you know we still get our drugs from her. It is what it is. 
So we're still working with her. She's just not in our gang right at the moment. She needed. She was working and focusing on other things. Okay. <laughs> but we are about to go meet uh the guy gang that's in our city. Okay, so we are at the boys' house, the guys' house, whatever you want to call it. My bitch is looking bad. She might cop her a man all in one. You never know. But we finna come and knock on the door so they, they, they oh, maybe that wasn't the door to knock on. Whatever, we in this bitch. <laughs> but these are the guys. They live a normal lifestyle, you know. You would never know that they drug dealers. But, oh, not a horny introduction. This guy right here is like a music lover. His name is Dallas. He's so handsome. I don't know what Buddy over here is doing. I guess he's jacking off. But, uh, East Easton, once he get his shit. Ooh, who she like? Colton. <gasps> Ooh, yes. She like Colton. I was looking for his ass. He fine as fuck, too, though. He was like the frat boy in college or whatever. So, yes, he has an education. But he is so handsome. So, we are going to get a horny introduction to him. Hi, sir. Hi. He's like not giving us a time of day right now. And I need him to get out of this chair. Yes. Uh huh. Oh, he liked that. Yep. But let's just <laughs> talk to Colton, you know. I just realized I ain't got no papers to smoke my drug. Talk about the wet dream we had. Even though we just met this man, I think he's going to be fine. Compliment. My sis is real bold. Because, I mean, like, she's, had, she's the leader of a gang. Like, she should be bold, you know. But she has nothing to hide. Ask about degree. Oh, you got a degree. Do you got a degree? Boy, if you finish school, we gotta have a talk. Let's ask him about his love life. Communications at Foxbury Institute. Period. Period. I love that. Let's flirt with him a bit. We are taking things to the next level already, bitch. Because my bitch ain't no scary bitch. Let's ask him about his sexual past. They are so cute already. Look. She's like, bitch, I can get anybody I want. And that's on period. Okay. My sis is a badass bitch. Let's compliment his appearance because he do look good. Might I say so myself? Let's exchange some numbers so he can start calling us and stuff. Because, like, I want you to call me. Like, make sure you call me later. Because I got shit to do. But make sure you call me. Okay, boo? Yes, sir. Thank you. Now, let's come over here and meet uh, Dallas really quick. Because my sis is really, really liking on Colton right now. <laughs> and I'm loving that for her. Okay. <laughs> I'm loving that for her. That bitch is like, bitch, you a drug dealer too? I'm living worried. Mm-hmm. Don't be flirting with him too. Don't flirt with him too. Be be civil. Okay, be civil. Let's ask him about his career. Do he not like me? He like, I don't like this bitch. Yeah, she coming over here trying to sneak out some shit. And that's not true. Okay, I really just came out here to be nice to y'all. But if you want to beef, we can fucking beef. And that's on period. We can beef. He is the leader of this gang. Because he's the most responsible and the most, like, chill one. As, whereas Colton is, like, he's the smart one. He has the education. But this guy is the hot head and he's stupid. So, like, <laughs> You can't trust him to be in charge of nothing, all right? In charge of fucking nothing, because he fucking stupid. But Colton got a little anger issue, too, but he know how to control it, because he thinks smart. Like, he's the planner. He'll plan out they shit, all right? Did you get his man his introduction, or like, wait? Get him this introduction, please, Could you? so you can get to know this gang. We're going to also play with the guys, too, because this is like a gang LP, but, you know. Sir... Don't start me. I told y'all he was a high head. See, he already fucking starting. Let me insult you, bitch. Don't play with me. Yeah, don't play with me. Just because I'm a bitch don't mean I won't fuck your ugly ass up. Don't play with me. Play with me if you want to. I will fuck you up, bitch. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and give this video a big fat thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. I want to give a huge fat ass shout out to Dimplicity for making my new intro. I hope you guys enjoyed that as well. And I will see you guys in my very next video or live stream. So, 
Bye, bitch. My haters give me clarity and popularity. I'm still fucking boss. It's a burden. Everything I serve it like a bird. Like Russian, Dutch, and German.